Hey everybody, welcome back to my Project 13. Thanks for coming on by and checking out this product review video. Appreciate your time and your support. Huge shout out to Ghost Tech. They sent me the Nautica Slim case series that are 12 foot drop tested and they're IP68 swim proof, waterproof, water type port seal to make sure there's no water that's going to get into the case to damage your Google Pixel 8 Pro. Got the black and the clear. They're both exactly the same case. They're both gonna have some black on them, but one of them's gonna have a clear back. Uh, back here, there's that information as far as up to 1.5 hours, multi-layered, slim, precise fit, raised camera lip, detailed cutouts, non-slip grip, and you get a limited lifetime warranty. So that is super cool. At the end of the video, I'm going to add a Ghost Tech short video that lets you know a little bit more about the waterproofing of these cases. So please watch the end of the video as well. But for right now, what I'm going to do is just unpack these cases and we'll start the case reviews. This is, this is a really nice presentation. There's the Nautica Slim, Ghost Tech brand name there. So yeah, that's really super cool. So what I wanna do is put the back of the case right there. Ghost Tech, we'll drop that there. You do get a lanyard that is super cool. And you get some uh, alcohol prep wipes and a dry wipe. Squeegee. Ghost Tech sticker. Can never have enough of those. Thank you for your purchase agent. You can follow Ghost Tech over at Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter slash X. Put that over there. Flash your equipment on TikTok, Instagram, hashtag Ghost Tech. We're giving out prizes to lucky posts. Put that over there. Here is the fingerprint ID operation steps. Please read everything. Okay? You're going to watch what I do in the video, but I still want you to read everything. And here we have the circular adhesive patches here. Extras. You got one on the built-in screen protector there. I'm going to show you how to use that so basically what ghost tech wants you to do is go into your settings and you want to go to uh where's my fingerprint right here and pam okay the instructions want us to clean the display, add a new fingerprint. But before we do that, we have to put the adhesive part of what's on the built-in screen protector onto the area where you put in the new fingerprint. So first we wanna clean off the display and we'll go from there. I already have my uh, wipe over here. And then we'll go into add fingerprint. And that's what you want to see right there. Then you want to get the adhesive away from that area. And you want to place this circular adhesive patch here over the fingerprint reader area. Okay, and that's where you want to use your squeegee. Okay. It's got to stay on there. There we go. Just like that. Remove that piece of film. Then put the top over that area. And then you want to rub down so the adhesive adheres. It sticks to the built-in screen protector. Then we want to take 
the back part of the case. Before I put the back on, I want to show you what this looks like on the edges of the back part of the case here. Got that clear back there. You got the camera area protected, flash, temperature sensor. So all the areas on the back that could be exposed are protected. Hard plastic polycarbonate material. very tightly this part of the frame actually is it feels like it's hard plastic polycarbonate material but i think it's just tpu and here is the seal that should pull away just like that. Wow, that is a very tight fit. I know this is going to be a long video, uh, but this is a first. And the reason it's probably having a little trouble going on is because I have that tempered glass screen protector, but that's okay. That is nice. You're gonna have the USB type C port right there, your speaker grill there and your mic area over there. And this seal here is going to make sure that everything is protected. Now your Google Pixel 8 Pro is already IP68 water and dust resistant. And then you have the IP68 water proof, swim proof, Nautica case, the Nautica Slim. Want to make sure that everything is tight. Now remember to watch the video at the end of this video. Wow, that is cool. Okay, there's your power button. And let's test out. But when you're all said and done, then you can take it off and use your regular Ghost Tech case, whatever you have laying around that you purchased from Gross Tech. A lot of lip surrounding the super actual display there. Built-in screen protector plus I have my tempered glass screen protector on the back. Cameras are going to be protected. That clear back there. That's actually plastic right there. This right here is our plastic polycarbonate material. This area here, that's a little bit of a thinner, thin layer of plastic. So uh, that's super cool. You get to see the bay blue there. The camera bump area there. Up top. Cut out there for the other mic. But yeah, everything looks great. Came together great had to figure it all out. Um, let's go ahead and test out that fingerprint reader. Oh, that is so nice to see. <laughs> that is so nice to see. Look at that. Yes. So everything working the way it should. This is the clear one here. Okay, as far as wireless charging. Boom, just like that. Okay, so we're going to remove this one. Oh, and you can sport the lanyard that you get in the packaging as well. It's an added bonus. Nautica Slim. That is the K-Series brand right there. Ghost Tech brand name at the bottom on the back there. All right. Well, I'm glad that all worked out. Now I have to remove the back from the front you got this area here that you can put your thumbnail in there and just pull away like that 
So what I'm going to do is I'm, I'm going to actually keep the frame of the front part of the case on because the only difference with this case is the back. Everything else is going to be the same on the front there. This is the only difference is that it's not going to be see-through. So we're going to have to then, depends on what you want. And just be patient. That's definitely TPU. At first, I thought that was hard plastic polycarbonate material, but it is TPU. I did a little homework on this case on YouTube, and there isn't much. And what there is, there's no detailed instructions on how to set up these cases. And uh, that's what I wanted to give you. Uh, and at the same time, get it right. So you can see how the back of this case here is just solid, solid black, glossy black. Kind of like that, actually. Really like that. Wow. Now, remember, this isn't something, unless you want to sport this case all the time, I, I would just suggest for when you're swimming or out at the ocean, the river, the lake, and it's because you want to take pictures. Uh, maybe you're on a hike, you're hanging out with the family on vacation, uh, whatever, and, and you're by water and you want to get in and you want to take pictures and shoot video. And, and you can do that out of the water too. Uh, but you just want to get that full IP68 swim proof, waterproof <laughs> in the water waterproof uh, uh, for your Google Pixel 8 Pro, and this is why you have the Nautica series from Ghost Tech. And again, all the information to purchase these cases will be down below in the description area. There's the clear, the black, very, very solid cases. Everything working the way it should. Um, just make sure you clean your display really well. Wipe down the inside, that way, uh, any kind of residue, anything is, is very, very limited. But again, when you're underwater, you're mainly going to be using the front camera and the, the cameras uh, on the back. Um, you don't have to worry so much about the display and utilizing that, uh, except for to get into the camera, obviously. So, um, and doing that is just simply tapping on the camera and you're swimming around. You see a shark at the Oregon coast and bam, you take a picture, maybe start shooting some video, whatever. Okay. So it doesn't need to be super, super clean underneath that, uh, as far as the built-in screen protector. But, um, yeah, that is super cool. Wireless charging. Boom. There you go. All right. Huge shout out. Ghost tech. A first, the Nautica series. I wonder if I can get this. Oop, I didn't bring that together there. Want to do this right. There we go. Look at that. So you would take. Slide it into one of those holes. Man. Come on now. Gotta get this right on camera. There we go. Like that. And then. Put that through there. And voila, boom, okay, just like that. That's an extra added bonus there, folks. All right, that's it. Boom, the other piece, the other lanyard. Shout out Ghost Tech, give me the opportunity to represent. Any questions, please leave that down below in the description area. And with that, God bless y'all. Thanks for hanging in there. Peace, I'm out.
Congratulations, agent. You have received your Nautical Slim waterproof device case by Ghost Tech. This video shall serve as operational support. Let us begin. Before installing, execute the following protocol. Open the port buckle at the bottom. Starting at the entry point, remove the back of the nautical slim case and inspect for cleanliness. Reattach the back by squeezing firmly along the entire perimeter, leaving no gaps. Firmly seal the buckle and submerge the empty case in water for 10 minutes. Remove, dry thoroughly and reopen the case. If the interior is wet, contact Ghost Tech HQ immediately. If dry, you may proceed. Thoroughly clean and dry your entire device, and carefully remove the fingerprint sensor protection sticker. With charge port and port buckle aligned, press your device face down into the nautical case. Reseal the case leaving no gaps. Use the included cardboard wedge to smoothly adhere the fingerprint sensor sticker to your device. Upon installation, you must rescan fingerprint identification for your device. Your Nautical Slim is IP68 waterproof rated, submersible 6 feet deep for up to 90 minutes, and military grade drop tested to withstand falls from up to 12 feet. Fingerprint ID and wireless charging compatibility remain fully functional while installed. Should you encounter any malfunction, report immediately to Ghost Tech HQ. This has been your Nautical Slim device case debrief.